What is going on guys, Tactical Bacon here, and thank you very much for checking out today's video, which is going to be something kind of different. Today we are going to be playing yet again another survival game. Yes, there are tons of these out online now, and this one is called Next Day Survival. Basically, it's a post-apocalyptic world set somewhere in a perhaps fictional or non-fictional town in Russia somewhere or like a Eastern European country. Not exactly sure where it's supposed to be taking place. However, it is a post-apocalyptic survival game. Like I said, there is PvP and PvE servers. Today, we're going to be playing on the PvE server. Actually, for the first couple of videos, we're going to be playing on a PvE server just to kind of get the hang of things. But anyways, that's all the setup you guys need for today's video. Remember, if you like it, to leave it a thumbs up and comment down below. Also, go join our Facebook group at YT Tactical Bacon. Go follow me on Twitter at YT Tactical Bacon. And without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump into today's video. What? One more time. I don't know. Probably butchered that all up. You know, it would really help if you assholes would speak to me in English. Let me come over here to this doctor guy. See, I was trying to do this quest on, I think it was another PvE server last night when I was trying to make this video. But unfortunately, none of that turned out very well, so... Yeah, I got it. Pick it up. Ooh. Sexy. Is it? Yeah. Wait. I'm kind of in like a weird outfit now, but okay. Alright, so there's a new mission available. And, ooh. It's more like my reward's gonna be some pretty cool shit. Alright, yeah. I'll accept that. Now where do I have to go? Okay, so... I'm gonna get away from this guy playing guitar because it's kind of loud. I gotta go to that guy real quick. Okay, so very quickly, um, I just want to go over a few things as far as like the inventory system. This is all shit that I learned last night. Um, the inventory system is actually kind of cool. Uh, up here you have your, obviously your character, your primary weapon. I assume this is where like a secondary weapon or like an axe or a machete would probably go. No, you can't push your machete there. Um, and this is where your knife or possibly machete would go. Yes, machete goes there. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's it's basically just a very simple uh, inventory layout. Uh, this is your, this is like their form of currency. Uh, so right now I have about 1,200, whatever that symbol means. I'm just going to say 1,200, a little over $1,200. $1,201 to be exact. Um, and then I've got some steaks that I cut off of a wolf. I mean, th this is all shit that I did yesterday, but unfortunately, like I said, that video turned out like shit, and I was not gonna upload that to YouTube. Um, this video actually may end up looking like shit too, it all really depends on the, uh, bitrate of NVIDIA Shadowplay. However, we're gonna go up here, and all I did really to get there was click on this little thing right here. And it takes you to your quest. Right now, I have to talk to this little asshole over here and get my gas mask going. Because apparently I'm going to be going to a swamp somewhere. So that's kind of exciting. Uh, let's see. Pick that shit up. Alright, so I'm going to have to drop that. And put... Wait, does it go in the spot of my hat? I assume... Okay, I had to take the hat off. Alright, so now I got this sweet-ass gas mask. Um, and now we have to come over here to get to the swamp and probably do something there. I think I have to get some kind of, like, needle or something. Uh, click on my little quest tab thing. Get to the swamp. Okay. Um, so the swamp is... This away. Um, there was a few things that I learned while playing this game last night. A few kind of cool things. What the fuck is that guy doing? 
a few kind of cool things and some of the points that I made last night I want to go ahead and repeat here because I feel like they're worth repeating um, I don't think this game is really going to be considered like a daisy killer like I mean it really all depends on your point of view some people think that daisy is still very well and alive while others may think that uh, it's pretty much dead in the water but anyways um, this is kind of in the same vein as Daisy. you know when Daisy came out it launched a whole lot of clones or whatever and this is yet again or yet another clone um, but not really uh, there's no zombies in this game or at least none that I've seen so far I mean we're playing on a PvE server I assume that there would be zombies on here too if there were any in the game but unfortunately I do not think that there are well, it really all depends on how you look at that, fortunately or unfortunately. Um, so, well, okay, this is clearly the uh, swamp area. Um, but I mean, right off the bat, like, as soon as it came out, I mean, it hasn't been out for that long, but it already has this PvE system where you're getting quests from NPCs with inside of the safe zone. I mean, it's really... It's weird because, like, you know, obviously Daisy is like a straight up survival game and it's not supposed to have any of that, but it would be kind of a cool feature to add in eventually. I guess this is why I have the hazmat suit so I can walk over here. Um, but yeah, there are, you know, like, like these quests, for instance, it's a good way to kind of get to understand the game, like the mechanics and how everything works. What do I need to get over here? This thing. Okay. How's it going, buddy? Obviously not too well. Can I get onto here? Oh, I can. That's so fucking awesome. Uh, first aid pack. I don't need that. Medium backpack. I have a medium backpack. And, ooh, a military helmet. I will definitely take that. And probably sell that and yeah there, there's like a little trader at the safe zone that I was just at too so that's that's pretty cool um, you can get food and all that kind of fuck 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 <laughs> fucking bear fuck off Trying to make a fucking video about this goddamn game. Why do I not have ammo? <sighs> Fuck me. This bear is gonna kill me, isn't it? God damn. <laughs> oh shit. This happened a couple times last night. Not because of a bear, but. Jesus, that scared the fuck out of me because at first I heard it and I was like, what the hell is that? Is that a zombie? And then I turned around and there's this fucking giant grizzly bear coming at me. Holy shit. Oh man, we're gonna have to go back out there and get all my gear. That sucks. Fucking A. Am I able to still do this quest again? It looks like it's going to somebody else. Or like the arrow is over this asshole now. Okay, I don't have to restart it. Uh, but for some reason, I can't accept it. So that kind of sucks. Um, fucking A, I'm gonna go back to my body and get all that gear back. I don't think it, like, marks where my body was, but I know it was out over that way. So yeah, I'm gonna quickly run over there and see if I can get my shit back, but holy hell. That was intense. I don't know why, I, like, I, I know I had ammo for that fucking gun. I don't know why it wasn't firing. Like, all I was able to do was fucking swing at him with it. And I mean, that's not going to do anything to a bear. 
Oh, this sucks. So that's probably why I needed the gas mask. <laughs> I don't even know how fucking far I made it away before I got killed by the bear. Oh, there I am. Thank God. Inspect the corpse. Oh my god. Okay, maybe, maybe this will help. <laughs> no, because I'm still, I'm still coughing pretty bad. Maybe I need to put on the hazmat suit. Come on, what the fuck? Okay. All right, it's it's still okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh, I face plant or face planted my corpse's asshole. That's nice. All right, so I'm gonna try a different method here because I think that they're kind of like on that side over there where I've got the the crosshairs. And I think last time I, I spent a little bit too much time looking for the bodies as opposed to actually like finding it and getting all my protective gear and everything like that on. So I think if I just come over here, it might be a little bit easier to get to everything. I just have to figure out the general vicinity of where my bodies are. I think they're over <laughs> in here somewhere. Just past the water. I may have needed to go up a little bit further. Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Yes! Okay, so I need that. Come on, I need that. I need this. I need this. And I need this. <laughs> Jesus Christ! For fuck's sake! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! Go! 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 Run your little ass off! Get out of this fucking area! Go! 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 You fucker! Don't die! Don't die! Okay, I'm out of it. I'm out of it. Or am I just, like, destined to die now? Uh. Yep. Well, okay, so I got the mask and the suit out of the zone, so I should be able to go back to the mask and suit and then go in and get the rest of my shit. So that actually helps. Okay, now that I have my suit back on, I should be able to come back in here and get my gear. Right? Yeah, it doesn't seem like it's affecting me. I just gotta figure out where that other corpse is. Let's see if it's still... yeah, there it is. <laughs> Both of them. Alright. We are... Back in business here. Uh, yeah, we gotta do that. And it's it's also really weird how you have to switch out some of the stuff. Like I'm sure that eventually they'll they'll get that fixed and taken care of, but yeah, it's kind of a pain in the ass for right now. Um, unfortunately. Take the machete. Okay, yeah. Um, unfortunately, I am not... Well, that's why I couldn't shoot, because there was no ammo in there. What the fuck? I had, like, two mags before I logged off last night. Alright, hold on. Maybe it's in that backpack. I gotta switch this shit out real quick. See, it, it's really weird how you have to do things. <laughs> Um, okay, so basically what you have to do in order to switch out a backpack, like if you die and you're able to get back to your body, um, at least this is the only way that I've 
found that you can... Oh no, I fucking ate the raw meat. Ah! Uh, I'm gonna die over here. Better get out of here. Oh fuck. Just dropped all this shit. Okay, well... Hopefully he doesn't die. Um, let's go ahead and drop that. But yeah, this is, uh, this is kind of weird. Drop, and then I have to drop the backpack. And then I have to, no, that's not how I do it. Okay, so let's drop the backpack over here. These controls are so wonky. And then let's drop this backpack on the ground right there. Then you have to pick up this backpack. No, no, stop, stop that, stop that, stop that. This is radioactive water, you fucking idiot. Jesus Christ. Alright. Yeah, make sure your cursor is right over the item that you want to pick up. Or else you're gonna drink dirty swamp water. What the hell? Okay. Uh, pick up the rest of this little shit. And take my Rolex because reasons. Uh, okay, now... Yeah, there, there was no ammo in the gun. For fuck's sake. That was the... Like I said, I logged out with, um... At least two mags in here the other night. Okay, so I wonder if I'm now able to go back over to that town and get shit going. Let me run over there and see if I can get this mission restarted. If not, what I have to do then is log out of this and then log back in. Like, there's, there's still a lot of bugs and shit like that that they have to work on, but... There, there are still workarounds if you're if you're just trying to do like quests and shit like that. Okay, this guy is taking a nap up against the wall. Except, okay, that worked. Now I have to come over here to this doctor jerk off. So I guess I just had to have my gear back. If that makes any sense, which. It Kinda doesn't, but okay. Sweet. I got another gas mask. Okay, so I guess what you can do with this, or what I'm going to do with this, is I'm gonna sell it. And get some mags, so when I encounter this bear again, I will not have any issues. Or at least, hopefully I won't have any issues. Uh, let's see here. Alright, so let's go into this. I think the gas mask was kind of towards the bottom. Okay, why isn't it letting me sell? Okay, there we go. Alright, so it only sells for 375 which, whatever. Raw meat, we'll go ahead and sell the raw meat. And... Yeah. Alright, let's get ammunition for this. Yes. Yes, I want to buy that. And why not? We'll buy one more. Okay. So now I should have ammo for this. So let's go fucking take care of this bear again. Alright, go through this murky swamp one more time. Jesus Christ. I hate that fucking chat thing that keeps popping out. Alright. Get this little baby doll. Shit respawn in here? No, not that I see. All right, let's just try to get away. I mean, I know I have ammo to take care of the bear, but I'd much rather get away. 
without having to deal with it. Okay, cool. I got away. <laughs> so maybe like the bear isn't like a persistent thing that keeps coming back at you. I'm not exactly sure. Maybe that was just like a freak encounter with a bear. But holy shit, that thing scared the fuck out of me when I saw it. Uh, so I guess now that we have this uh, injection or whatever the fuck this thing is that I came over here to pick up, I completely forgot about what it was because I was so worried about trying to have a gunfight with a bear. Well, not really a gunfight with a bear, although that would be funny. Um, but yeah, I... I at least have ammo for my gun now, <laughs> so I guess I can take that away with me. But yeah, like I was saying, this uh, this chat thing right here is a big pain in the ass. I hope they do something to fix that, um, because when it comes up, you can actually hit uh, right control and it'll go away. But as soon as somebody types something and sends it into direct chat, obviously the thing comes back. So you have to keep tapping right control if you don't want that shit to keep popping up on your screen so i hope they do something about the global chat like i'm i'm not exactly saying make it like daisy like daisy mod where it's all like in the very bottom left and you don't have this annoying window that keeps popping out every time so yeah, all right yeah, <sighs> nope sorry they get all butt hurt if you have a weapon Alright, so now I have another weapon with two more mags, so that's kind of cool. Um, we'll go to this guy for another quest. Oh, sorry. Okay. Oh boy, you've been with us for a long time. It's time to decide which side you're on, my friend. As the saying goes, try to choose the lesser of two evils. You're either with the looters, where life is free, fun, and entertaining, or, excuse me, interesting, and sometimes horribly short, or you're with the civilians, where there's a chance to become someone and settle down around here. Even if it's not the friendliest of places. Both are struggling to survive, it's not going to blah 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 blah. Okay, so it's asking me to choose basically whether I want to be... I guess a bandit or a civilian? Um... Really not sure where to go. So... We're just gonna go with... A looter! And he's gonna be giving me more shit. Okay, cool. So is that like the... What is this? Okay, I guess this is like a... Weapons thing? Are these just all magazines? Yeah, they're all magazines. Okay. So that's kind of interesting. Wait, I thought he gave me another gun. I guess not. Oh, I'm hungry and thirsty. Go ahead and use this. Uh, yeah, I guess from here we're gonna go ahead and cut this video and the next video we'll try to go out and look around the world. Um, as I mentioned in the intro, I'm not really gonna be doing like the whole PvP thing or the PvE thing forever. Uh, eventually I am going to venture onto the PvP servers and everything, but the first, like, I would say four to five videos are basically going to be me doing PvE stuff just to kind of simply, you know, get familiar with the controls and the way that the map is and everything like that, so, uh, you know, leave it a thumbs up if you liked it. If you didn't like it, then, you know, just skip these videos, I guess. I don't know what to say. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it for this one, and we will catch you guys in the next one.